I need one of you guys on the south side, one of you guys on the north side, hold all traffic on the key bridge. Uh, there's a ship approaching that just lost their steering. So that until you get that under control, we gotta stop all traffic. Yeah, we're all, I'm in route to the south side. I'm just about to start. Ian, uh, I'm holding traffic now. I was dragging, but we stopped prior to the bridge, so I'll have all out, out of the traffic stopped. Ten four. Is there a crew working on the bridge right now? K nine one, but they out. Good. Let me stop traffic on this flight right now. Yeah, if we can stop traffic, just make sure no one's on the bridge right now. Uh, I'm not sure where. Uh, if there's a crew up there. You might want to notify whoever the foreman is, see if we can get them off the bridge temporarily. Ten four. Once the other unit gets here, I'll ride up on the bridge. I have all interlude traffic stopped at this time. Once you get here, I'll go grab the uh, workers on the key bridge and then stop the outer loop. C-13 dispatch, the whole bridge just fell down. Start, start, whoever, everybody, the whole bridge just collapsed. Simple dispatch is direct. That's correct. This time. Do we know if all traffic was stopped? I can't get to the other side, sir. The bridge is down. We're going to have to get somebody on the other side, the Anne County MSP, to get up here and stop traffic coming northbound on the T-Bridge. C-13, I'm holding all traffic northbound. I'm on 695, headed towards Burry Highway here with the police. They are reporting that the middle section of the bridge collapsed into the water, and there are unknown amounts of people and or vehicles in the water the entire bridge, the entire key bridge in the harbor. Be advised, the entire key bridge has now collapsed into the water. The entire key bridge has now collapsed into the water. Proceed with caution. It's 152. Battalion 1 at command. Battalion 1, go ahead. MTA State Police, their incident command location is going to be located for them as far as the MTA Police. As the AOC Center, 2330 Bruning Highway. They have representatives there to try and get footage up. They are reporting they knew the ship was running um, off course prior to the class, and they started clearing the bridge. Um, all the traffic, all the construction stuff, and a few vehicles were stopped prior to the collision. Can't copy that. If you have a liaison with them, see if you can find out if this ship was inboard into the port or if it was outbound. They're trying to ask Shane now. Um, do you have a representative you want me to send to there, or do you have another dispatch chief sent there? Are you able to make it to Burning Highway, or are you isolated on the bridge? Isolated under the bridge. Um, not able to get back out this time due to traffic all being backed up along there. Okay, I copy that. Command communications. Go ahead, command. I need a special call a chief officer or a command level officer to the MVTA command post. Over on Browning Highway. Message received, 221. Now you want to command that it's going to be located at 2330 Browning Highway. There will be a door access code. I'll give you a phone number and a relay uh, for when our chief gets there. Message received, 221. Fire rescue boat to the command be advised. The vessel was outbound. It appears to be outbound. At this time, the vessel also looks sound. And it has a large piece of the bridge resting on the bow. Command to truck 21. Truck 21. Go ahead. Truck 21, you're going to be the staging officer. I need you to ascertain a better staging location that's outside of this parking lot. Truck 5 on the road. 141. EMS 6 on the road. EMS 6 141. Unit is responding on rescue alarm, I-695 East. Be advised, 13 persons possibly in the water. There was a 13-person construction crew operating on the bridge possibly in the water at this time, 146. Six to communications. Are you advising there's 13 people in the water? Possibly 13 people in the water at this time, a construction crew. Okay. Let's go ahead and special call Baltimore County Marine Unit 269 and Marine Unit 216. Notify Anne Arundel County to also stand by for their boat. 
Communications copy. One forty four. Talk five communications could be good. Can you guys test my FTP, please? Talk five, I copy one for the The six to communications. Also, awesome. uh, dispatch the dive unit on this call to alert the dive team and start one more additional transport unit. Communications copy, one for the five. Time Chief One, communications. The time Chief One. You have a landline with MTA police. See if anybody got a location. Better location on the bridge, east side or west side, and on the outbound lane. Okay, so it's safe. Um, the Coast Guard actually called it in and said that it was just off of Fort Onset Park. I gave the deck coordinations to the fire rescue boat. We can try contacting MTA police. I right, one copy. Well, 46. Battalion 6 to 1, uh, it was a CAD error that you were dispatched. I'll let you use your discretion. Battalion 6 to 1, we'll keep coming in. We'll come in from the burning highway end, east side. Okay, you'll be accessing the inner loop of I-695 across the bridge? Yeah, we come down Browning Highway to a dumpster to 695. We'll uh, post up that way, see if we get anything, and you'll be posting from the other end of Fort Martin State. 6 okay. EMS, EMS, repeat. We got an exit. That's the negative EMS. We do not have exit at this time. We're trying to get more information. Sock 5 to Battalion 6. 6, come in. Yeah, Chief. I went over to Fort Armistead and I'll see if I can't get eyes on anything from there. Okay, copy your Fort Armistead. Staff coordinator, I'm in route. Staff coordinator, in route, 148. Communications, Baton Chief 6. Code 19 has been notified. I'm on board. Engine 13, 148. Time 1 of communications. Get all the MTA police ASAP. I have. MTA police cars heading a different direction than us. We need some information from them. Communications copies, Battalion Chief 1. We are trying to contact them right now. Battalion 6, Engine 13, you're responding with one diver, is that right? Battalion Chief 6, that's affirmative. Engine 13 has one diver on board. Copy. Engine 57, clear the air. Engine 57, clear the air. I'm on 695. Headed towards Burning Highway here with the police. They are reporting that the middle section of the bridge collapsed into the water, and there are unknown amounts of people and or vehicles in the water. We are committed to 695 in a traffic jam. That's as much information as I have right now. I'll be command. Time Chief 6 to communications. Go ahead, the Time Chief 6. Alert Baltimore County Engine 57. Have them respond on the inner loop. Dispatch the two remaining squad companies. Prepare for backfill of SOC units into the city. Communications, copy, command, one two. SOC 5, Battalion 6. Uh, probably a bad idea. I'd make a recommendation to the Coast Guard. They're right around the corner so they can be of assistance to us. Battalion 1, communications. Go ahead, Battalion 2, Colin. You got Foxtrot or MTA State Police en route? With a helo. We are still trying to contact MTA police, and we will contact Fox Stride as well. All right, as far as MTA police, you can reach out to state police if you got contact. See if we can get a state trooper en route. Message received, 151. Command the communications update. We do have several, several police officers on eastbound 695 that, is, that are stopping traffic. So no more vehicles try to enter. We're going to try to get as close to the bridge as possible to get a better look, but I don't want to commit to the bridge if it's unstable. Sock 5, communications and audience responding, hold the air. Sock 5, battalion 6, and communications on Fort Armistead, be advised the entire bridge, the entire key bridge in the harbor. I advise to hold all traffic from committing to the bridge. I advise again, the entire key bridge has fallen into the harbor. Message received. Unit responding on rescue alarm I-695. Be advised, the entire key bridge has now collapsed into the water. The entire key bridge has now collapsed into the water. 
Proceed with caution. It's 152. Units responding on rush to alarm key bridge. No units access the key bridge. I repeat, no units access the key bridge. 159. Engine 57 to command. Command, go ahead. We've done a quick search up here in the bridge with our tick and visually. Uh, we're clear of any other cars or uh, civilians on this side. We just got us and a few police officers here, and they cleared out all the rest of the traffic. You want us to just stand by up here? That's correct. Go ahead and stay by where you are. Copy. Rescue one to command. The police boats here at Fort Armstead. I have one victim conscious. Do we have a medic on the scene? That's correct. We do have uh, one medic unit up here on top of the boat ramp. Can you advise in a priority of this patient? I'm trying. At least a priority two. Got a copy of priority two patient, medic nine. Stretcher to the top of this boat ramp for a priority two patient. Nine, go. Battalion one, two, battalion six. You got the Fort Armistead side? That's correct. Command post is established at Fort Armistead. Okay, do you want to set up a different area uh, for our side? Also, I'm trying to get visual on top of the bridge to see if there's any remaining cars up top side and get cleared. We also have MTA police. He's here with night vision. He's scanning the water from the uh, North Shore. I copy that. Fire rescue boat one command. We're on scene. Would you like to stay out here and search around for people in the water, or you want us to come over really to uh, Fort Armstead? Go ahead and proceed searching. If you can, from a safe area, avoid any areas around the bridge that may be in danger of further collapse. Copy that. Uh, it looks, it appears to be a cargo ship hit the. Uh, center span of the bridge made it collapse. Rescue one to command. Rescue coming. Eight construction workers were on the bridge according to the construction worker. We have one. There's seven unaccounted for. He said there was a dump truck, a pickup truck, a large truck, and a Nissan car that he knew of that was on the bridge at the time of collapse. But there is at least seven unaccounted construction workers. Okay, I copy. Right, so we're unable to get to the park. We're on the other side of the bridge with BC-1. Battalion 1 to 6. MTA State Police, the guy who's with me, he's reporting there's no cars remaining on top bridge. We're trying to confirm. Also, do we have a uh, structural engineer route? Stand by 1, BC-1. Six to one. Do you have a, a liaison with somebody from MD, the Transportation Authority Police? Yeah, he's here. He has uh, night ops goggles on. He's standing out on the water. We have a cargo ship. He's taking down the complete center span. Uh, he's not picking up any heat sinks or anything on the water as of yet. Okay, copy that. Ascertain from them if the bridge was open at the time of the collapse. Our rescue boat too. We're also on the scene. We're patrolling the area. I recommend Foxtrot if it hasn't already been requested. Foxtrot's down. Maryland State Police have been requested. I believe we got an aircraft already overhead. Battalion Chief One, go ahead with your message. Communication. Everything that the bridge was open, limited traffic, like one lane each direction. In addition to the construction workers, we're trying to get a someone who has cameras for the camera bridge location. So we review that. Communications come in. Trooper One is up. Okay, I, co I copy that. If possible, if they're not on Baltimore County's power group, I'd like them over here. We'll see if we can make that happen. Who's that? Command and communicate. So, uh, preemptively, we're going to declare this a mass casualty incident level one. Uh, go ahead and fill out the remainder of the mass casualty assignment. We're going to need those west side units. No one from the east side who can access via the key bridge. They're going to need to come through down to Fort Armistead Park. Communications copy. Mass casualty. Two zero five level one two zero five one two BC one. I'm with a rep right now. Uh, they just unlocked this gate here, and they stated the bridge was open. It was hit by a container ship, causing the fire rescue boat too. Update: the bridge has been completely destroyed.
Car five attachment to that. Car five two zero five. Come in, did you copy? I copy that. We need to make sure that we have representatives from the U.S. Coast Guard on the way. Notify also Maryland. Rescue group from Marine. Rescue. I'd be advised we're going to have Squad 262 go over to the uh, fuel dock over at Hard Guy. And I want to make contact with my other unit to get over there. We have a key to the gas pump. So as soon as we can get that coordinated, we'll let you know. Very good. Marine assets, all marine assets from rescue. Uh, all refueling is going to be done at Hard Yacht. Once Hard Yacht open, we'll let you guys know. When? Two six nine from rescue. Uh, I, I know this is a weird request, but uh, try to track all fuel. Whatever you need, possibly pictures, whatever you need to do right now, or something. Uh, so that way we can track all fuel consumption, so we can get reimbursement. So we'll go ahead and start documenting. Uh, pass that on to uh, Met Twenty One as well. Rain from Rescue. Eric, how many boats do you have currently stacked up right now? We're on the way, correct? Yeah, I'm coming from Harper County. All right, I would say uh, once we get that, let's hold up. Uh, I'll double check with ADO. Who were the last two that you have responding? Three fifteen and fifteen two from Harper County. Copy that. I'm going to call ADO right now and uh, talk with them. I think uh, with what we have, we're going to be uh, good. I think at this point, it's going to be uh, a uh, long process. Yeah, right now I have plenty of swift water and dive assets here. Everything's just stacked up ready to deploy. Copy that. Rescue from Marine Command. Go ahead, Marine. Hey, if you can go ahead and pass it up higher up into the chain, see what options Trade Point Atlantic may have to offer in terms of refueling. I didn't hear your last transmission. It came and broken up, uh, but I believe you're asking what I uh, had stated in my previous. Uh, go ahead and pass it up the chain to see what uh, Trade Point Atlantic may have. In options as far as refueling. All right, I'll uh, I'll try to get one of the safety officers on that and see if uh, they can make contact with uh, Trade Point. Rescue from Marine Command. Rescue. To be advised, uh, the State Fire Marshal's bomb squad has an underwater drone. I'm not sure if it'll be any assistance, but it might help us get through some of this debris. All right, stand by. I'm sitting next to uh, one of the MSP members right now. I can make a call if we need it. Let me know. Uh, we'll we'll take care of that on uh, our end. I'm talking doing a face to face with uh, one of our assets here. All right. We just made that request. We're going to try to get that here as soon as possible. And uh, I will uh, once we figure out where they're coming from, either the uh, southern side of the Key Bridge or the northern side, we'll let you uh, know that we can get that to you. Okay, it's definitely going to be the southern side. They're going to be coming from uh, like A County. So. Copy that. If that's the case, I'll have them report to uh, Fort Armistead. That'll work. County Marine Division from Rescue. Go ahead, sir. Hey, just got an update on uh, the city side, just to make you guys aware. It appears, appears that the, uh, I guess, the cargo vessel is uh, is leaking uh, diesel fuel everywhere right now. Uh, Road Direct, just be advised. We handed off our key to Marine Unit 268. Marine Unit 268 will be going back to Hard Yacht to set up the refueling point. It'll be in service momentarily. We'll advise when. Very good. 268, once you get the uh, fueling dock set up, uh, like I said, please record everything that you use somehow. That way we can uh, keep all that track. Hey, Eric, I'm sure you've heard the uh, conversation that we just had about the uh, excessive amount of fuel coming out of the cargo ship. So uh, we need to uh, try to set up decon over there. That way, uh, as the members come back, especially the divers, we can then uh, set up a decon and get uh, contaminants off of them. Okay, do I have a decon unit coming here? Rams to rescue. Right, Eric. Just as an updated status report, is Baltimore City actively working in the water right now? And do we have an idea of the number of people that are actually in the water, or is that still all unknown at this point? Uh, on our side, that's still currently unknown. I can uh, try to make the request and see if we can find out on the City Talk group how many uh, people are in the water. I, I don't think they have anybody in the water. If, there, if anything, they've found a couple cars, and they're doing some shallow water dives, marking cars. Rescue from Marine Command. 
However, we uh, we are listening in. We are confirming there are at least 20 workers that are missing that were working on the bridge when the collapse did occur. And uh, that 20 is on top of the other multiple vehicles that plummeted and submerged as well. Copy, thanks. <clears throat> Eric, I'm trying to figure out a way to get you uh, the decon unit. I'm just trying not to deplete all the uh, other assets we have in Barnum County right now. So do you, do you have anybody there? That is not SOC qualified that we could probably push away and try to set the decon up. If not, I'll just make the request and get 54 starting your way. Thank you. Press speak from Marine Command. Marine Command, go. Per the U.S. Coast Guard on VHF-16, they're advising they've got at least 13 to 14 in the water. And uh, I think I heard an earlier transmission saying at least three or four vehicles that were on the bridge at the time. Yeah, when you say 30, 14 in the water, you're uh, talking about civilians, right? not uh, not rescue divers or anything? That's correct, civilians. Very good. Do you have eyes on uh, on the city assets as far as, are they uh, are they uh, putting divers in the water? Earlier on, they were putting divers in the water, searching a couple of vehicles, at least one tractor trailer more towards the east side of the bridge. Uh, at this time, we're not, we don't have any eyes on any uh, city personnel in the water. Yeah, there's not much we can do at this time. Uh, we're just still continuing with searches, looking for uh, any more vehicles. But uh, at this time, we're just going to be continuing with searches. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> do you have a boat that's readily available that we could free up and send around to uh, Rame Division? And then that way, they would be able to pick up possibly, preferably, two divers. And that way, if we do find something, it's a quick deployment for said divers. As far as Met 26 goes, our research is pretty used up with us there doing searches. And uh, to say, run the key back to Hargia, uh I'm going to go ahead and try to make contact with Met 21 on City 419. 219, we're here. Man, you can go ahead and call your message to 219. 219, are you able to uh, free up a boat and uh, come around to Range Division? And then that way we can get, um, get preferably two members picked up. And that way, if we do find something, it's not a. Uh, you know, 20 minute ferry for uh, Swift Water to get over there. Not for a beat uh, platform for that. Roar. Very, thank you. Range the rescue. We're going to send a drive from the scene on the 54 to pick up the decon. Very good. Well, uh, I'll have ADO notify them and uh, tell them that the uh, unit's fired up and uh, get whatever else we want it set up and uh, it should be worth for them. Thank you. Also, Eric, if you can get uh, two additional divers stacked up with uh, all the ensemble, we're going to have 19 come around the uh, uh, water to pick them up, and that way we dive back in the water. I also have you taken here with two divers on it ready to go as well. All right, well, let's, uh, let's hold them with that unit right now. Do you have additional divers that we can give to uh, uh, 219? Yeah, we'll make it work. Awesome, thanks. We have Cal Tilbers. Say that again. Yeah, Caltopo and this one. No, good eye. I'll, I'll get that fired up on my laptop. Go ahead, 262. 268 has just fueled up at Anchor Bay. They're getting ready to leave Anchor Bay. Do you need them deployed somewhere else? Marine Command from Rescue. All right, we're about to drop a pin for a uh, previously searched tractor trailer, and uh, if we find anything else, we'll start marking it too. All right, awesome. Also, can you drop a marker for the south side of the bridge, the last section that's standing, and the north side of the bridge, the last section that's standing as well, so that way we can uh, identify how far of a span is missing. All right, also, range division from rescue. Good. Hey, uh, 269 had an outstanding idea of getting uh, Caltopo up and running, so we've got that up and pinned. Uh, Say if we can, any that we deploy from your side, try to put uh get them up on Caltopo so we can actively monitor and that would be so. Hi. Thank you for Marine Command. Two six two is just advised on three two that uh two six eight is fueled in the water. If any other units need to start fueling up, they can go ahead and make their way over there. Copy that. So I want you to uh manage that from your side with your water assets. Um Wait for them to come back and then send whatever unit unit you need to. Uh, that way we at least keep uh, two unit uh, marine assets out on the county side of the uh, harbor. Rescue from Marine Command. Rescue Group Supervisor from Marine Command. 
Rescue. Okay. Hey, can you switch up on TAC 35 if it's not used? Can you and I talk on 35 or just you guys switch to 3 to communicate back and forth with boats? No, you have just me and you. Yeah, switching up. Marine uh, command, you. Go ahead, Rescue. Hey, where's the city to pull their divers right now? Do you know? We can find out. We'll, uh, okay. You can put that spotlight on those pictures you sent and illuminate that little more. So it looks like there is uh, heavy debris in the sections of the bridge. Is that right? All right, we'll go ahead and uh, try to get you some better pictures. Um, 217 did mention that they've got a couple of points of interest off the uh, cargo ship. Once 219 gets out here with divers, we'll see if uh, we can start accessing those. Copy that. Does that look like it's on somewhat stable parts of the bridge, or is that areas that are completely collapsed? In fact, the team team verification, but uh, we'll guide you in a little bit. Yeah. BTR1 from Rescue. Hey, Marine, give me a call on my cell phone. Right. Marine Group, or Marine Command. Stand by. Marine Command from Rescue. Go ahead, Rescue. Sorry, I'll phone. Go, uh, go with your message. A couple of things. One, uh, they are uh, taking the divers from our armor slip here on the soul as, as they move through vessels. So that's where all the divers are holding the nation there. Coast from your side, try to put, uh, get them up on Cal Topo so we can actively monitor them. That would be fun. Rescue from Marine Command. Uh, T62 is just advised on 3 2. Uh, 268 is fueled in the water. If any other units need to start fueling up, they can go ahead and make their way over there. Copy that. So I want you to uh, manage that from your side with your water assets. 